Good morning, good morning. It's Annabelle here. Welcome to Monday Meditation. Today it's all about self-love and how much we need to look after ourselves and how much we need to be aware of the good things we can do for ourselves so we can be with others and caring for others with care, compassion and kindness. So, yes. All right, so find a comfortable seat and feel the seat, feel your bones on the seat and feel your hips, the heavy weight of your hips on the chair. Feel your feet on the floor. And then we're going to take three deep breaths, breathing in through the nose and out through the mouth. And then again, breathing in through your nose into your chest, opening, opening, expanding your chest and then out through your mouth. Letting go of anything, any tension that is here, anything that happened maybe this morning. And then again, breathing in through your nose into your heart. Feeling your heart with beautiful oxygen. And then pulling out any tension, any feeling that is there. And settling beautifully into your body. From this place, we're going to bring all of our attention in our heart. So our heart is where we connect to the ethereal, to the cosmos, to the gods. And that's where we evolve as a human being through connecting to that heart. So be present within your heart and you can bring a big, beautiful emerald ray around your heart. And then you can imagine a little triple flame within your heart And this triple flame of your Shakti, your energy, is going to be traveling, awakening different parts. So this triple flame is going to travel down. And go to your solar plexus, bring your attention to your solar plexus. And then further down to the navel chakra, connecting to the navel chakra, the sense of self, where we build confidence. And then further down the base chakra, and then the root chakra. And we can open and open the root chakra. We can open all the chakra from open to receive and open to connect. And then bringing the attention and the slit of flame down the legs, down the feet, and down into the earth, connecting to Mama Earth. And going through the different layers of the earth, connecting to all the crystalline layers. And that's why we. We love crystals, you know, because there is some part of crystal within ourselves that connects us to different structures. And then we connect, we have big roots coming out of our feet, so connecting into the earth. And here, connected with the earth, we can we can just rest and we can feel the energy coming back up and holding us. You are held, 
You are loved. You are perfect right now. Feel how Mother Earth is holding you in perfection right now. How everything that is right now is so perfect. And you can rest in the bosom of the mother. And then we connect back to the heart. And from that place of the heart, we're going to move up to the upper chakra. And then up to the throat chakra, opening the throat chakra, our communication, our expression, our truth. And then up to the third eye, connecting to our intuition, opening to new ideas. And then up to the crown chakra. And opening to the Father God and the cosmos. New ideas. And so I don't know how new is this idea of self-love for you. But a few years ago, it was a very new idea for me. And for me, I just love this idea. And I thought, there is something in that. I know there is something in that. And so I found that the best way is to really be open to give ourselves this self-love. So let's just put this intention now to say, I am open to give myself this love, this unconditional love. And I am open to receive from myself this unconditional love. We're going to rub our hands together, create some heat, a candle here, create some heat, and then we're going to put our hand in our face, and we're going to touch our face very gently, we're going to hold, we can put our hands in our cheeks and just hold ourselves, you know. And we can feel ourselves so deeply. And then slowly, we're going to move down the neck and the chest. And as we move down on our body, we just, you know, we just give and receive. Give the touch. We receive it. You know, your hands together. Give touch. Receive touch. Give touch and receive touch. And then slowly we go on the breast and on our heart space. And we can put our hands and feel our breast, and we can give a little massage and then slowly move and open things so we can get to the heart because we know the heart is right there. And we just give a little bit of love, just give a little bit of love, a little massage. One way, other way. And then slowly move down the belly and really hold our belly, touch our belly, feel the belly. 
what is present there in the belly and give the love and receive the love. Give the love and receive. And then down into the legs. We can touch our legs and we can go down. And then to finish, we can give ourselves this beautiful big hug. Big hug. I give to myself and I receive love. I give to myself love and I receive from myself. I give unconditional love from myself and I receive unconditional love from myself. And then as I'm here with my eyes closed, fully inner, I can ask the little girl, what do you really want? What makes you really sing? What makes you happy? What do you love to do? Is it singing? Is it dancing? Ask your little girl and just be open to receive whatever she tells you. And the first thing is usually the right one. We don't want to overthink you. We just stay present with that little girl within ourselves. What does she want? And then promise, I promise you, I'll give you that. I'll give it to you. Every day, every week, you know, what do you love? I can give you. And then we put our hands back in our belly and we connect to our creatrix, the creative center, the base chakra, navel chakra, and here. We ask our creatrix. What makes you happy? What makes your heart sing? What do you love to do? What do you love to feel? What can I do for you so you feel fantastic? What do you want to create that is going to be amazing in the world for yourself, for the people around you? Wonderful, wonderful. Make sure you note the message, what she wants. And then if it doesn't come now, it's okay because you open that door and she might tell you what she wants a bit later on. So just to be open to that, to be open to receive those messages. And then again, Bring your hands on your head and connect to your head and your mind and ask your mind to rest. So thank you. You don't need to look so hard. You can just rest. You can just be with the breath. You can just be with the breath. And massage your head. Massage your head. Massage your temple. I said your forehead. I say, look, you don't need to stress so much. You don't need to worry. You are perfect. Everything is perfect just the way it is. Everything is perfect just the way it is. You are perfect. And then sit with this beautiful feeling of feeling perfect, of feeling perfect. 
of being loved after receiving so much love. And slowly, slowly bring back your attention to your heart. Thank you to your heart. And then you bring back your attention in your seat, feeling your seat, feeling your hands, feeling your feet, wiggling, wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Taking a deep breath, nourishing, expanding breath. And breathe out high. of letting go anything that prevents you from going into simplicity. And then slowly, slowly, when you're ready. Open your eyes, come back to the room, be kind, and remember those messages from your little girl and from your portrait. They're all those different parts of you that really help you feel good, you know? We create for ourselves and for others. Whatever it is, it can be art, it can be a meal, it can be a holiday, you know, it can be just a bath. It, it, it can be so many things. It can be a course. It can be business. You know, it can be what can I really create in my business that other wants? That's going to make me very, very happy to, to deliver. Because when we connect to that place of love and unconditional love in our heart, then we can create from that place as well. So thank you, thank you. If you're on my YouTube channel, subscribe to my channel, share with your friends. And uh, if you need any help, links are in the comment to, to connect to my newsletter, to want to um, come to the meditation live, you can do that. So, and then if you want to get Oracle Guidance live, you know, you need to come live. You can come in my Zoom or you can come on Facebook Live. So you choose. Um, yes, lots and lots of love.